I, although this might sound weird, I needed all of what I went through. Yeah. I needed it. It was seasons of preparation of what I was praying for, of what I was asking God for. I'm getting real emotional. My glasses are fogging up. Oh. <laughs> uh, nah, real shit. No, I just, I, I, say, I, I, needed, I needed everything that I went through. And although it was painful and although it was, it felt like it was breaking me, I think God, I not even, I think I know that God knows exactly how much breaking I need and that he didn't break me to hurt me or to harm me, but he broke me because, to create seasons and moments of dependency on him, not other people, not the people I was dependent on. Mm. He had to create seasons and moments for me to depend on him. Mm. You religious? So, so. I don't call myself religious. Spiritual. I believe in Jesus. <laughs> that's all. Okay, okay. <laughs> that's all. I, I could go with that. Yeah, that's all. Just the Lord Jesus Christ. Yeah. And he will deliver. Yeah, that's all. That's and... all. But I mean, also, you know, I told you earlier on the phone that I don't drink anymore. Yeah, that's and what I wanted to bring so up. So I don't that's literally I, what I was gonna me bring up by the way. Drinking is not because like, of spiritual over. purposes. It's because you want to make better decisions. It, was a, it, well, it led to bad decisions. Yeah. You have to find the root to all the problems. Yeah. That was literally the root of so many bad decisions. Mm. It was the root of so many bad decisions. And once I started to think about it, like all the bottles on my on my fridge, yeah. dumped them. Yeah. People called me crazy. Yeah. People said I should have gave it to them. Yeah. But me dumping them... <laughs> he knows. <laughs> His brother, me brother said, "Hey, them, I was one of them." Me dumping them yep. was a physical representation of this exiting my life. Okay. I mean, Casamigos. I mean, Hennessy. Not like, the Casa. I mean, big bottles. Yeah. I mean, big bottles. White rum. Like I dumped everything, mm -hmm. and w one of the main reasons why I decided to dump everything and not drink anymore and become a mocktail girl. It's crazy. <laughs> become a mocktail girl. Yeah. Ew. <laughs> It's just Gross. juice. It's yeah. just a fancy word to say juice and a yeah. bunch of sugar. But yeah. became a mocktail girl um, because I wanted to stay focused. Focus. Yeah, this I knew that the season that I was stepping into required all of my attention. Okay. And drinking liquor and smoking weed yeah. would have been a distraction for me. Yeah, yeah. I don't care about oh, anybody, anybody else. else. Yeah. I don't care about anybody else. Yeah, I know. I hear what so, you're saying. You know, you're saying, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You're saying yeah. that just because that's your demon, that doesn't mean that's everyone else's that's demon. That's not, and I do yeah. not, would never dare say that. Yeah, about nobody else. You can yeah. drink your liquor. Hey, drink, drink your casa. Drink your, your casa. liquor. It don't got nothing to do with me. Smoke your weed. Smoke your weed. <laughs> <laughs> that, <laughs> the casa. You, you a oh, handyman? Yeah. You a handyman? Hey, <laughs> I didn't mean, get you. Mm -hmm. Yo, well, I mean, hey, brother. Uh, once, once you put enough pineapple in anything, oh, for sure, you can. I can go. I don't down drink no more, but just like some cocktails, oh you know what I'm saying? So, uh, I resonate with a lot of stuff you're saying. I like that. This yeah. is the purpose of this podcast. This is. <laughs> This is what mm, I feel like. I'm getting way too deep. I'm this is so what, sorry. This no, is literally I, how I talk. Nah, like, cool. when the cameras are away. Yeah, it's cool. Promise you. No, nah, I just you. be. I'm glad that you're like sharing a lot because, like, you know, I want to hear more. Mm -hmm. I want to understand um, what makes you you, and I feel like all those things that you've gone through in the past a uh, couple years or last six months, whatever you want to say, has shaped you to become a better woman today. Um, you're not saying that just because you went through the stuff that just you went through doesn't mean everyone else has to go through because everyone has their own walk and journey to step into. Mm -hmm. But you're saying that the moment you say no or want to change your life, it's absolutely possible to do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, that's, I think that's empowering. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling you, we can sell this. I mean, <laughs> we can wrap it up in the He's box. Like, wrap it up. And then it's push selling. it out. For sure. T-shirts. Sure. I don't know. I got to figure it out. I'll be back <laughs> to you. a quote on it. Yeah. Yeah. It got to be... <sighs> Purpose-driven life. Mm. You do this for a living, huh? <laughs> a little, a little I'm an bit. entrepreneur. Yeah. I sell everything. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. You just... I sell everything. You just be content creating and shit. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, so... For sure. <sighs> purpose. Purpose what? Purpose-driven. I feel Purpose like somebody has that. Life. That's probably LLC. 
It probably is. Yeah, they probably trademarked that already. But I bet you they didn't put on a t-shirt because I haven't seen it yet. <laughs> Maybe. Bet, yeah, probably not. Essentials. Probably not. I don't want it. Mm-hmm. Oh, all right. I'm a lot less nervous now. I'm like, Good. I'm did, glad. I, did I make you comfortable? Oh, no. Yeah. The yeah. pink socks are really doing that for me. Oh, yeah. These are... These... I'm so small. These are actually from high school. I've had these for years. I used what? to be a cheerleader. What? Yeah, like breast cancer awareness week, we used to like do all pink. That's adorable. I've had these for like 10 years. So what made you put it with the fit? I wore long boots here. Yeah? You know, the short, when you put the short socks in it, they just slide down when you wear long boots. Never mm. had these before. They don't mm. stick. This one stick. Okay. Yep. Oh, so ankle socks don't stick. Yeah, but I couldn't find any. I was trying to rush to get here. Yeah. So you just do one. I just do on the pink socks. It, it works for you, girl. Thank you. You're welcome. Appreciate it. I yeah, hope they can't see it. No, I definitely need to zoom out. I hope they can't I'm see so it. I'm so happy this is Did on Did you hear me? Right I was now. like, let me just roll them down a little yeah, bit. Yeah, no, it's there. It's out on the internet now. It's not going nowhere. Oh, Lord. That's okay. I'm not doing that. It's all with style. Oh, just purpose driven. Purpose. Oh. Hold on. Put on a t shirt. Put on socks. Awesome. Yeah. Um, what was I going to say? I wanted to talk about more about your beauty side. Mm-hmm. Um, because they actually dudes like I know that are going to watch this podcast. Not for good reasons, of course. That's all right. You know, you watched it and you learned something and you're going to go and you're going to change it and make good things. Diff- you're going to make. Better gonna, choices. Better choices. Good choices. Yeah. See, that's the problem with the people that I think that are going to watch this. I think they're going to use it and use it to their most, like, devious intentions. Mm. You know, because, you know, that la- that last thing, I'm telling you, it's not going to go to a good place. <laughs> you don't think so? <laughs> I don't think it's going to go to a good Because some, now, now when some man get tight, he's going to be like, oh, that's why you got, what's the, what's the lashes called? Uh, kiss lashes, kiss cluster lashes? lashes. That's why you got cluster lashes. I'll be tight. Mm. Yeah. No, if they, if they wanted to get devious, they would look up where um what lashes used to be called back in like the eighteen hundreds. Umbrella lashes. I don't know why I know that. There was <laughs> another name for them though. Come lashes. Yeah. I don't know why I know that. I don't know why. I've I been know on that the wrong either. parts of the internet, brother. I listen. No, I, dude, I actually well, learned that from a man. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like most men crazy. would know that. That's because crazy. That's the only thing you can argue about when you're talking about lashes. Come on, brother. No, they're, they were originally called no. umbrellas. Umbrellas. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah because yeah. back in like the 1800s, uh, again, um, dirty with it. dancers used to wear them. Yeah. Yeah. Crazy. And I think prostitutes, prostitutes too. Prostitutes as well. Yeah. Yeah. So, crazy. Um, boy, we came a long way, right? <laughs> kind of. No, well, we yeah. definitely did. I can attest to that. Okay, okay. Long way. I don't know if I can. Yeah. Um. So, what is your favorite? What What's the fight side of the be the world is your favorite? Is it uh, the makeup side or is it the uh, the the, 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 la- Lash the last side? Lash extension skincare. Is I it, personally um. Is the skincare? I feel like I'm the most passionate about makeup because that's where I started. Okay, why and makeup? Makeup. The reason why is because makeup allows me to express my artistic abilities more it yep. allows me to be more versatile yep. with lashing i do love lashing i enjoy it mm. over the last three years because i've been like i've been certified for like three to four years now yeah i have gotten pretty good at it and i'm really fast now mm-hmm. um so don't poke no one eye out yeah i'm pretty fast now like i had yeah. two clients before i came here yeah and I used to be really slow. I used to take five hours for a client. Now I take like two hours, one in, one hour, 45 minutes to two hours on oh, a Oh, you're set. just advertising yourself now. Yeah, she for said, sure. I'll take 30 book minutes. Me. What? Yeah. For sure, book me. But yeah, I do love doing makeup. I would say that's number one because yeah. it allows me to be more versatile. I also, second, I would say lashing for sure. And third, I would say skincare, but skincare is honestly right there with makeup for me because as I learned more, as an esthetician student, I fall in love with it more. Yeah. I fall in love with the process of analyzing someone's skin, being able to tell them their skin concerns, their skin conditions, their skin type. Oh, what do you think about don't. me? Don't. 
Africa. Tell me, tell me how it's so funny because as soon as I started esthetician school, yeah. all of my clients on my bed to get their lashes done mm. asked me if I could do skin analysis on them. Okay. Yeah. Oh, so you just a 